Hey everyone, today I'm gonna do my current favorites video. So without further ado, let's get started. For beauty, I have been loving three uh, lip products. All of these are from Beauty Alchemist. I'll link them down below if you want to go check them out. So the first thing that I will be talking about is the Wet n Wild Natural Blend Lip Shimmer. And for me, I don't use this as a lip shimmer, but I use it as a lip balm. This is a tinted lip balm with um, a, hint, a hint of a mint in it. So yeah, I've been loving this so much. And it can be worn as a lip shimmer uh, on its own. I have, I'm wearing it under my lip gloss right now, which I will be talking about next. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Slicks lip gloss and this stuff is amazing. I have been wearing this on its own when I'm feeling lazy and I don't want to put lipstick, any, any lipstick on. So I just wear these two together most of the time as I am right now. And next lip product and next and last lip product is the Rimmel London Cake Moss Lipstick. This is in um, 01. It looks like that. It is really red and I have been loving this on my lips. I love the smell of it. It smells like vanilla and I am... Ooh, I got <laughs> lipstick on my nose there. Um, I, I love vanilla scent and it is really uh, moisturizing on the lips. Uh, it doesn't really dry my lips out like most lipsticks do. But this one is a keeper and products that I have been loving recently is my CoverGirl eyelash curler and this is one of the best eye curlers, eyelash curlers that I've used so far and I've heard shimmer ones are great but those are kind of expensive and the next thing is my Wet n Wild CoverGirl press powder and this is in uh, 824B light medium and this stuff is uh, amazing. It, although it's hard to open, okay, no. this is one of the best pressed powders that I have used so far, and it is the perfect powder to my skin tone. And it does leave my face matte, and it really, really is amazing. Um, I really do recommend getting this. I got these from Beauty Alchemist. And now for fashion favorites, I have been loving this maxi skirt. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a maxi skirt that I got from Forever 21. I got this recently on sale and I have been loving it. For these types of fabrics from Forever 21 that are not aren't garter type material on the band of the skirt don't really fit me well they're really big on me even though it is my size but this particular skirt fits me really really well I guess it fit me it fitted me because of this inner skirt I, I pulled it out this inner skirt um, right here it's kind of like bandage skirt uh, spandex so it is it will um, get the shape of your waist and your butt and it has two slits uh, as you can see I can pull it I can um, divide it in half so yeah I've been loving that recently it has sunflowers all over the print so I've been loving that I guess I would pair that with my boots or related item is these shoes. These are from Fit, Fit Flop. Fit Flop. Um, Fit Flop or Fit Flops? I'm not sure but it looks like that and I am seeing the trend of these sandals recently so I thought that it would be great if I own a pair and I found these. These are real leather and I got them on sale so it was a really great deal. So I've been loving that. It has suede 
um, suede material here. It has some buckles. Although it's quite um, small for me, because uh, it was the only size, but I got them anyway since it will expand the um, the wobble board, as it is called, like the whole big shoe will expand after some time. So that is great. Another fashion favorite is this gold necklace that I have been wearing so much. I guess you have noticed in some of my videos that I am wearing this a ton because I, it's, it's, it, it's just a simple necklace but it can finish out an outfit really, really, really well. So I've been loving this so much and my mom gave this to me so I don't know where she got it from. The last fashion favorite that I have right here is my green, army green Lacoste bag. This is actually for me and my mom to share, um, but I have been loving this recently since she's not wearing it as much anymore because it's just a small bag and it's really plain and I love the handles of this. Um, one thing though, it doesn't have a long strap. I used two long straps and put it over, um, over my shoulder, but this particular brand, uh, this particular bag, uh, you just put it on the crook of your arm. So, nonetheless, I still really, really love it. I've been loving getting Franks. Don't judge me. And I also have another one here. Say, let me get it in a plastic bag. I got it. I got three or what, four Franks. I just got on a sale in the department store. It was a hundred for two pounds. Oh, it was a hundred pounds for two pieces, so that was a complete bargain. So I will use these two on my walls. And these two I got, I got from my parents. I don't know where they bought it, but this one says love on it. It says love, it's white. It's not wood though, it's plastic. But I really, really, really love it. And another is this long one. It says happy on top and has pictures and well I would put this on my wall I've been loving that another random favorite is food it is the Starbucks caramel cream or cream caramel frappuccino uh, recently I've been not loving the Starbucks coffee uh, I used to order cotton candy I love that that is my favorite I recommend it to everyone and before I used to order caramel frappuccino, right now I've been hating the coffee. Like the coffee, uh, it's when it's towards the end of the cup. I hate the taste of it. It's quite strong for me, so I've been ordering the caramel cream frappuccino from Starbucks. And the last favorite that I've been talking about is online shopping, and I've been shopping for makeup, shopping for clothes online recently, and I have been loving it. Online shopping can be really addicting for me, but nonetheless, it's great. I've been loving it. And two shops that I do recommend um, checking out is uh, Beauty Alchemist and Velvet Kiss Boutique. I will link them down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my current favorites. Let me know what your favorites are in the comments below, and I will talk to you guys soon.